Hello everyone and welcome to this very quick video. It has to be fast because my doggies are staring at me right now and they want to go out for a walk so I can't be long guys. But this one is a quick one. Basically, um, I've been asked about a million times in emails and comments, please try this very strange render scaling hack that everyone's raging about in the forums. Basically, in a nutshell, if you set your PC render scale to 200%, apparently in VR, the clarity is just off the scale. It's like so much better and you get zero performance impact. So we're going to try this right now in the Quest 2. So if you're interested in what my take of it is, stick around. We're now going to go in the sim and see, quite literally, if I can tell there's any difference. See you in a moment. Okay, so we're in the sim. It's not a fancy view, guys, today. As I say, I'm just doing this test. And you know what? The Quest 2. What a bloody great headset this is. I love this headset. It is brilliant. I'm on Airlink right now, and uh, yeah, the display in it is absolutely superb. But anyway, I'm not here for that. So, right, at the moment, this is 100% render scale. Uh, I think I've got my Oculus Airlink settings... I can't remember what they are now, to be honest, but it doesn't really matter. What we're going to do now is go into the settings. That's the wrong thing. Sorry. Hang on. Go back. Back. No. Discard. There we go. And, yeah, this is going to be interesting. We're going to go to PC. And we're going to change the render scale to 200%. Let's see if there's any difference. I'm going to be really, like, concentrating now. Here we go. Apply. And back. Right, uh, no, there's not any difference at all. <laughs> it looks exactly the same to me. And, okay, here we go, guys. I'll be honest, I've also tried this in the Reverb G2 just in case, and there's no difference there either. So I don't really know what's going on there, even yet the performance. I'm doing that side to side because I can see if I've got motion reprojection working, and it's working as fine as it was before. So there's no degradation in performance, but there's certainly no visual difference either so for me yeah sorry guys absolutely zero difference with this render scale hack now i know there's a number of you out there that swear by this uh tweak hack whatever you want to call it and you think it makes a difference well if it does for you that's great uh and i'm very pleased for you but honestly just no difference at all in fact let me just go back again just quickly just to see and I've also done this and restarted the computer, by the way, before I get loads of comments. I have a, tried this on the G2, but some people said it works, you know, better on the certain headset. But I can't see how it would, guys. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, there's just no difference. And I'm disappointed. I want to be part of that crowd that uh, clearly sees a difference in uh, the clarity. But uh, no, it feels exactly the same. That's it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. See you again next time. Bye-bye for now.